President Trump, welcome back to Meet the Press. Thank you. I want to dive right into this, a lot to get to. Good. There are a number of things that make your campaign unprecedented. You are the first former president to run for re-election in more than 100 years. You are facing four indictments. You have an incredibly significant lead in the GOP primary polls. But I want to ask you this, Mr. President. Why do you want to be president again? Well, it's a very simple answer, and I can give it uh, very easily. It's called Make America Great Again. Our country is in serious trouble. Uh, I don't think we've ever been so low in terms of certainly opinion, world opinion, and uh, country opinion. People are devastated. They look at what's happening with uh, millions of people coming in, millions of illegal immigrants coming into our country, flooding our cities, flooding the countryside. I think the number is going to be 15 million people by the time you end this. Uh, by the end of this year, I think the real number is going to be 15 million people. They come from prisons. On NBC, I saw a poll and I saw some statistics and it said in 2019, there were no terrorists. They caught no terrorists. There was nothing that they saw. There was no anything. And now, this year, it's a record number like they've never seen before. So we did a great job at the border. We did a great job with the military. We did a great job with inflation. We had essentially no inflation. We had a great economy. Uh, and uh, we didn't have an Afghanistan disaster. We were getting out, but we were going to get out with dignity and pride, not the way they got out. That was a surrender and an embarrassment and horrible. We gave $85 billion worth of equipment to the Taliban. We had uh, death, so much death and so much horrible destruction. And uh, it was a terrible thing. I think it was the lowest point in the history of our country. Now, with all of that, we can change it and we can make America great again. And that's why I'm doing this.